I'm sure you've been keeping track. Just kidding, I'm sure no one cares. The last time that I got my hair professionally cut or colored was I think December of 2017. Many of you remember the days when I would bleach my hair, put all kinds of colors in it. It was really a good time. And then my hair started to feel like a bag of Doritos. So I took a long break and I haven't touched my hair in years. But I am getting to the point where I am incredibly bored. I wanna do something to my hair, but I'm enjoying the fact that it's very healthy and grown out right now. And YouTube be like, here's a bunch of videos on how to make your own wig. Yeah, I'm sure I could buy a fun wig and put it on my head and feel really great about myself. But you know what? Why not make your own wig? Now, a lot of these videos are people sewing in wigs, which seems like the next step for me. But thanks to the power Power of YouTube, I've learned that you can hot glue yourself a wig. So that's what we gonna do. Leave all your judgment at the door because I'm gonna make a hot glue wig like any other regular adult. I need an extension card. Um, I did get human hair because most importantly, out of anything, I want this wig to be a fun, exciting color. And they did not have a lace closure at my disposal to purchase. So good thing I looked up on YouTube how to make a wig without a lace frontal closure. So we just go and basically hot glue it to a cap around in a circle and pretend like nothing's going on at the top. Do you think I can pull that off? Also welcome, what's her name? Fleb. Don't name her Fleb. All right, welcome to the channel, Fleb. Should we leave her here? Yeah. Like, it's kind of nice to have company, honestly. Yeah. I want to say I've watched about three whole videos on this. I'm going to make it work, because that's what we do here at the salon. Am I right, Julian? We make it work. We make something work. <laughs> was that a, a jab at me? No, it was a right hook. Do not right hook me. One of these is shorter. I think I'm going to be using this for the top layer. And if it gets really messy, we can just cut some bangs. So, we all know how good I am at cutting bangs. Why do I feel like you're judging me? All of you. Just like everything else on YouTube, I watched it a few times and I feel overqualified to do it because I have scissors and hot glue too. So like, <laughs> according to YouTube, if you have a phleb, cover their face. Wait, you're suffocating her. Suffocate phleb. No, no, she needs to breathe. Is this the wig cap? It is, isn't it? Wait. So, funny story. Uh, I opened up my wig cap. I asked for help at the store and she gave me like an actual wig cap. So obviously this is not gonna hold any hot glue or hair. So I forced Julian to run back to the beauty store without me and get one that we can actually glue onto. I don't know how to position this because see how loose and baggy this is? But it needs to be like stretched. Doesn't it? See, if I put it here, right? Yeah. Well, how am I gonna attach anything to this? But the hair has to go to like here. Ugh, I'm so confused. Just wish me luck. Starting in the back. Like this hair is about to go through a lot. You know what I'm saying? Poor hair. I am eventually gonna need a brush. Well, it's a hula skirt. I don't really know what to do here. All the YouTube videos I watch, they're like, yeah, here's your cap, and then just like get going. Jam it on there and start at the nape. Nape. You know, like here ish. Is this your nape? <gasps> oh my god, I have hot glue in my hands. What's wrong with you? Oh god. Kermit's barking. This isn't sticking. How am I supposed to dye this? Ow. Why am I struggling? All right, then I think maybe we like do that for a little bit and then we start cutting it. What do you think of my wig so far? It's okay. You can't have this shit be lifting, you know? Or else it's gonna be a dead giveaway that I got a wig on. I should probably chill out on using so much hair for the nape. Ow! Because we have a lot of head to cover and I only have three of these bundles. A lot of head to cover. Hey. What's wrong with you? I'm gonna start cutting this because we gotta start like going all the way around, you know? That looks oh. fine, right? Yeah, you're doing great. That looks good. Jenny, you're doing good too. Flat, great job. Jenny, good, good job. I feel like this is harder than I thought it would be, but also easier. It's just like hot and like messy and inaccurate, but like pretty effective. I see all these videos on YouTube and I'm like, I could do that. I could do that. Maybe sits here struggling. I don't Fleb, you look beautiful. Hold on a second. Fleb, you look beautiful. 
which I think Ow, is. Are you okay, Fleb? Why are you so concerned with Fleb? Um, she's a guest in our house. We're supposed to dye the hair first. No. No, I mean you can. Some person on YouTube said that the hot glue will hold, so I'm just gonna put all my eggs in that person's basket. Oh, I'm dripping everywhere. See, you really gotta set down your hot glue gun and not just let it drip all down the hair because it's definitely in there a lot. Running a salon, it's messy business. This is our kitchen. Like it's such a cool art form. This hair art, you know, beach. Flip, how you hanging? Fleb is fine. If it hurts, just say something. So, Julian, do you want to tell them what color we're going to dye this? Orange. Oh. Will you stop acting like it's your head that I'm cutting this on? I'm having a very difficult you time. Can imagine, okay, say you make the hairline right here. You can fold this part under when you wear it. This is like a lot harder than I thought it would be, like trying to figure out where the hair goes. My brain's not really working that well right now. I can't really figure this out. Your brain looks cute today. <laughs> Said the x-ray technician. It's not gonna look good. Uh, everyone's gonna make fun of my homemade wig. I've already used a whole pack of hair. Hair doesn't grow on trees. It, like, Actually it does, they're called people. <laughs> it like doesn't look right. <laughs> what do you mean it looks totally normal? <gasps> so most of the, the videos that I've seen on YouTube, they make it in like a U shape, but I'm just having a hard time because something's wrong with Fleb's head. Whoa, whoa, easy. I don't think this is the size of my head. It just seems wrong. Why, why are you laughing? No. I mean, <clears throat> oh, what do we got here? Hmm, this is satisfying. Did you just put that in your mouth? No. It's actually like, it's holding way better than I thought it would. I mean, I trusted the people on YouTube, but like, they were right. Ow, ow. Oh, I put my finger right in it. Yum. I put my thumb in it again. <laughs> tell me I'm a garbo wig maker. It's You're okay. You're talented and wonderful. You're you doing a great job. Tell me the truth. The measuring was a little off on that one. Stop judging me, all of you. I'm getting increasingly more nervous about the top and center of this head because I feel like I've seen a bunch of different different methods, but I don't really, I haven't decided which one I'm truly gonna go with yet. I think I'm just gonna like cover it in hair and hope for the best, you know? Wing it, baby. Put in the, the wig and wing in it. Nice. But like, what's all this? Like, what do I do with just this? Just hold it under. What if it doesn't fit my head right? Then you're just gonna have a black bar underneath your hair. <laughs> Isn't that a dead giveaway that I'm wearing a wig? No, it'll just be like cinematic. You know how cinematic? Black, you know how I have black bars on cinematic video? It'll just be like that, but in real life. Choo choo, the track came off. So one method I've seen is people gluing it. They start to glue it like this. Like bangs? Yeah, but like back, like you don't have to be bangs, like you could still part them. Or you just keep making this smaller so that it turns into nothing, pretty much. What should I do? I don't know. Well, I'm running out of hair. Should I just keep going around in a circle? Yeah, maybe do that. Okay, I'm stressed. Good luck. Should I just glue the whole top of the head? What? I'm running out of hair and I've never seen anyone do it like this. <laughs> Look at this. Oh no. How much hair do you have left? I, this much. Oh, I don't know what I'm down doing. down to the wire. I, I thought I had a plan, but. Right, am I just gonna have like a black part? See how it's all folded? Like this is garbo. So why don't you switch to the front method now? With the no, last... it's too late for that. Oh no. Oh my God. Like that. <laughs> Look at this. That's hot. Yeah. <laughs> Don't Will Smith in my wig. Let's do telescope. It's rewind time. <laughs> Wait, how did everyone make this seem so easy online? Like, despite what any of you guys might think, I'm genuinely trying. I really tried. Oh, it's so bad. This is like the last little piece that I have. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Alright, don't worry, I got the piece that's gonna save it. That's not gonna save anyone. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay. Sick, dude. Nice wig. I think it looks good. Definitely doesn't look like something out of a horror movie. <laughs> oh my god! What did I do? 
I still don't even know how the front of it's gonna work. When you turn in your test to the teacher, when your teacher asks you to show work. <laughs> All right, you know how you can help me? What? Fill this up with hot water so it at least can be a cool color. This is the technique I again saw on YouTube. I'm just gonna dump some hair dye into this water. Oh God. What? Here's a different orange. We can get some dimension. Kermit, get out. Yeah, that's dimension, all right. That's vomit. <laughs> What's gonna save this way, Julian? Is dimension. Here she goes. <sighs> I kind of want it out of my life already. Jenna, it's okay. Okay. Wanna see what mommy's making? It's a wig. Kerm, make sure you get right up in here, bud. Don't miss a second of the action. Oh, it actually came out pretty orange. Yeah, I like the color. That's pretty cool. You're gonna need your muzzle. <laughs> this is why she's muzzled. Don't take that off, please. So much dimension. Kevin. Bunny, got you a present. I'm gonna go take this upstairs and dry it, and I'll come down and reveal it to you. Does that sound good? Let's see what happens. Should I chuck this in the pool? Or no, what? no. All right. Well, that took almost my entire life to dry this. I at one point debated just throwing it in the dryer. <laughs> I didn't like flat iron it because I figured not even a hot tool is really gonna save this. So why put it through that? Just remember how much time and energy I put into this, and don't laugh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it looks good. Ah, I tried to tuck it in some. Come into the bathroom. What if I part it somewhere else? Does it look good? <laughs> All right, we'll say the color is dope. Right, the color came out so good. But aside from the front, a little bit of cap showing, like it looks good. How about you just put a headband on? Oh, that's a good idea. I like his style. What about just a hat? Is this your hat? Yeah. Who is she? What about now? Does it look natural? <laughs> Stop laughing! No, it looks good. You look made it. You made it. You have to be easy on yourself. You made this from nothing. With a hat, it's not that bad, right? No, it looks really good. It feels pretty comfortable. You just have to pray for no wind. Okay. Right? right? Okay. Okay. With a hat? Oh, shit. I probably could have bought like a $20 Party City wig and gotten the same effect, you know? This is definitely more expensive and labor intensive. Like if you're gonna wear a wig with a hat, you know, you can buy a really cheap shit wig because you're just gonna throw a hat on it. But I think the point of making your own wig is to be able to wear it as a wig. No, the point of making your own wig is that you made your own wig. Like, you did it. Now offering at my salon wigs with hats. <laughs> what? I'm gonna sew the hat into the top of it so it's part of the wig. What? That's a good idea. Does it look natural? Yeah, like so natural. Kermit. Never felt so defeated. Oh. <laughs> I don't like that sound. I don't like that sound. No, it looks good. It looks good. I feel like it doesn't. Good. What's giving it away? Is it the black cap? Yes. It's actually like super dope. I know you're being hard on yourself, but you made a wig and it came out like if you brushed that a little bit, like and styled it, like it's, it looks good. It looks like hair. I'm not gonna brush it or style it. No, but I'm saying it has potential. Too upset with it. Okay. You wanna dry it on? Sure. It looks like a meme wig that you get at like a football game. Who's orange? Go team. Who's or Who's the orange team? I don't know, but they're gonna win. It looks kind of good on you. All right, take the hat off. Yeah. It kind of looks like a built-in headband. Wait, what are you doing? Honestly, you looked a little terrifying. It's something about the shirt and the hair and the tattoos and the scissors twirling. Like, I'm genuinely a little afraid. It's, oh. Come here, close. Come here. My head is wet. I know. <laughs> okay, can I? Julian. You did a good job. You should be proud. High five. Ah, 
I just got tired from that high five. I feel like we should hold a funeral for it. No, don't. Should I at least pour out some of my 40 for it? Yeah, pour out some of the 40 onto it. <laughs> <laughs> this took a long ass time, but it was definitely worth it. How is it way, worth it? Shuts off, flab, dude. Can you link her YouTube channel below? Your head did me so dirty. Don't, don't kill her. Your head literally fucked everything up. Stop, Stop blaming Fleb. Who should I blame, me? No, I don't wanna. wanna. I really, really genuinely tried to do this sort of the way that people told me to on YouTube and I feel like you need God tier skill in order to pull this off and make it look good. I tried so hard and I got so far and in the end, I wanna hold a funeral for this wig. <laughs> I really wanted to try this because I keep watching videos of people making wigs and I'm like, that's so cool. Like, I would love to do that. I would love to try that someday. And you know what? I did and I found out not everything is for me to try. This is an abomination, Julian. Someone grew their hair out and then cut it. Shout out to that Link their YouTube channel too. <laughs> Just the worst thing I think I've ever made. Can I burn it in the fire pit? No, you can't burn it. It probably smell pretty bad, huh? It doesn't smell good right Just now. Just smile and wave. This is part of my life. I'm never getting back, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Come here, sweet boy. Here, honey. Can wear a wig. Does it look nice on him at least? He looks beautiful. I tried, I failed. I cannot do this. But if you want to come to my salon for the low, low price of the cost of all the materials and the hair and very expensive labor, I will make you a wig that you can wear under a hat. That's it. That's the new service that I'm offering in my salon. And uh, good luck getting an appointment because there's only one. I'm just selling this one. I hope if you ever make your own wig, it looks better than mine. I messed up. That's it. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. I put on interviews every Wednesday slash Thursday. Do I need to like... Hello? Is there something going on between y'all? Hello? See you guys next week. Bye!